influenza continues to surge. The Taiwan CDC reported 18 new severe flu cases in a single week, along with two more deaths. Two of the severe cases involve a two-year-old and a seven-year-old who were rushed to intensive care units. Meanwhile, the fourth wave of COVID is still surging, driven mainly by the XBB variant. Officials estimate that there are more than 20,000 new COVID cases each day, given that more than 200 cases with complications are being reported daily. We estimate that the number of positive cases is about 20,000 per day. We anticipate the peak to fall around late June. Patients who don't use antiviral drugs compared to those who take Paxlovid have 2.11 times the mortality risk. If comparing unvaccinated older adults or those who only received one or two doses against those who completed all three doses, the mortality risk is 1.81 and 1.55 times higher respectively. To encourage vaccination, the Taiwan CDC will give a 500 NT coupon or a promotional item to adults aged 65 and above who get a third shot. This campaign starts on Wednesday. Officials say the mask mandate will remain in place at medical institutions, nursing homes and welfare institutions for older adults. Starting May 31st, masks will no longer be mandatory at facilities including homes for veterans and youth service centers, but they will be strongly recommended.